Hi everyone, if you want to make 3 years, 4 years and above 5 years aged plants within a short period of time, please watch this video completely. This is Dr. Ram Krishna, a scientist with organic chemistry background working on the rooting aids formulation. In this video, we are going to make plant of the plant using reverse approach grafting. It looks like air layering, but it's not air layering. It's a combination of both grafting and air layering techniques. The core principle involved in this technique is the grafting. Let us understand this grafting in a much better way. So what is grafting? Initially, in the grafting, the cyan is joined to the rootstock, where they fuse together, grow as a single new plant. For that, we need to do the match cut on both cyan as well as the rootstock. So their cabium layers overlap properly and this ensures that they can fuse and forms the callus and connects the both xylem and phylum cells for a successful grafting. The key point for the grafting is the alignment of cabium layers of both rootstock and cyan. And this is what happens in the grafting. Based on the grafting principle we discussed, what we do here, reverse of it. That is, instead of grafting cyan to the rootstock, we will graft the rootstock to the cyan. That is the aged branch we have chosen. Technically, we are attaching roots to the aged branch so that it will become a new plant in the future. So once you understand the basic principles of grafting, it is very easy. First of all, choose a branch of desired age group. So we would like to personally recommend you to go for 1 to 5 years of branch age for higher success rate. Why? Because the cabium activity will decrease with the increasing the age of the stem or branch. So the higher the age of the branch, the lesser will be the success rate. This grafting technique will only work both cyan and rootstock belongs to same family or closely related to each other. According to branch age and stem diameter, we need to choose the number of rootstocks for the aged branch. So in this demo, we have chosen the mango branch belongs to the 3 to 4 years of age group. Now we need to make patches on the bark of the branch we have chosen by exposing its cabium layer to make sure that the thickness of the patch is matched with the thickness of the rootstock so that they can fit in perfectly. So the ideal choice is the pencil thickness. So now we need to place the rootstock in one centimeter gap around the branch. If you want, you can also change the arrangement as shown in the video. Okay. Off rootstock above, off rootstock below. And after attachment, tie them carefully. And if you want to, for better root development and fast root development, you can also use the root enhancer. Now we need to make the chamber for roots to grow. For that, we will take the a free size poly cover and tie its bottom end as shown in the video. Next, fill with cocoa pit. Then tie the top end. This is how we make the rooting chamber. Now final and important step. In this step, under the rooting chamber, we will make a 2 inch circular cut by removing bark and scratching its off cabium layer. It serves as the same purpose as in the air layering to force the nutrients accumulate and dependency on new root stock by accelerating graft union. So usually it takes a lot of time to develop roots inside the chamber. So keep cocoa pit evenly moist. So why do we make plants using this method and what are the advantages? The main advantage is the time. Within a short period of time, we will get a well matured ready to fruit tree with all the qualities of its mother tree. The plants prepared by this method can be grown in grow bags, containers and in the terrace garden. Right. So here is the demo video of my mango plant which is made by using this reverse approach adapting technique. So generally you need some practice and precision to make these aged branches into new trees. So we want to keep this explanation as simple as possible 
without using more scientific terminology. Thank you very much for watching my video. If you found this video informative, please like and share. For more plant-related videos, please subscribe to Cronus. Thank <laughs> you.